Over the last few days, there have been some truly remarkable events. Here are two major stories that you probably missed, which are crucial in the aerospace sector. One of the first stories I came across was about Brett Adcock, the CEO of Figure. He recently stated that only now has the time come to scale to billions of intelligent humanoid robots, something that wasn't feasible five years ago. He emphasized how fortunate we are to be in 2024, the first year when this is possible. He's referring to the Figure product, so I'll let them explain it further, and then I'll show you why this is so remarkable. There are a few important points I want to discuss regarding this robot. One key aspect that many people haven't realized is that this robot represents an electric upgrade. A recent industry trend shows that humanoid robots are increasingly adopting electric power systems over traditional hydraulic or pneumatic systems. This shift is driven by several key factors that make electric motors more advantageous for the development and deployment of humanoid robots. It was quite subtle, but you can indeed see that it's labeled as an electric humanoid. This marks its entry into the electric humanoid sector, which is quite fascinating. Boston Dynamics also recently announced their new robot, which was showcased as an electric humanoid in their video, indicating a clear industry-wide trend. Additionally, an interesting feature noted was the significantly upgraded hand which appeared to have an increased grip area resembling the tactile sensing found in Tesla's Optimus robot. I found this robot particularly impressive. While the fluidity of the previous bot was nice, this one also stands out. The electric systems tend to be less costly and easier to maintain compared to hydraulic systems, which are complex, prone to leaks, and require regular maintenance, making them expensive and time-consuming. In contrast, electric humanoids are cleaner, simpler, and generally have lower maintenance needs, making them more practical for widespread use in various applications, from industrial settings to home environments. Additionally, noise and environmental impact are crucial considerations, as noise reduction is important for robots in home and work environments. This robot is expected to be released in about four to five days, depending on when I publish this video, which should be shortly after recording. Comments from the founder, Brett Adcock, indicate that this is likely to be a remarkable engineering achievement. I find this incredibly fascinating because if we look back at Boston Dynamics' recent electric humanoid, we see that it appears remarkably flexible in terms of standing up, moving around, and navigating its environment. This will be an intriguing piece of future technology, and I'm curious to see how it compares to Boston Dynamics offerings. Their recent Atlas robot, which is currently in development, is the successor to their previous system that was widely admired. This new robot is remarkable in its human-like appearance and capabilities, demonstrating an impressive level of flexibility and agility. It can perform a wide range of tasks with a degree of finesse that makes it a standout in robotic technology. Now, one of the key things he mentioned is that this has been engineered for over a year. Figure 2 is the most advanced humanoid robot on the planet. I have to be honest, as someone who follows the humanoid robot space closely, I haven't seen any company make as rapid progress as Figure under Brett Adcock's leadership. In the short time the company has been dedicated to its mission, their advancements are unparalleled. While other companies in the field are making strides, Figure's progress stands out without casting any shade on them. We have to acknowledge the remarkable speed at which Figure has managed to develop a next-generation humanoid robot. 
not only is this robot poised to be ready for significant AI upgrades, but it has also been engineered in just over a year. The fact that they are already releasing their second robotic demo, which appears to be industry defining, is truly impressive. It shows what can be accomplished when a company is led by a determined entrepreneur. Just four months ago, we saw the introduction of this robot with a speech-to-speech -speech update, which surprised many. It demonstrated the remarkable capabilities we can achieve with our current systems, architecture, and hardware. This progress is encouraging, especially since there's a common narrative that the technology space is decelerating and going through a trough of disillusionment. However, if you closely follow the developments, it's clear that significant advancements are still being made. You can see that the technology is becoming increasingly capable and impressive. Honestly, looking at the entire humanoid robot space, this robot stands out for its remarkable agility and flexibility. It was one of the first robots able to talk, which was quite surprising. If they can develop something even better than this, I will be truly impressed and surprised. Meta is making waves again with another open source model release, introducing the Meta segment Anything Model 2, known as SAM. This model is highly effective at precisely segmenting selections in any video or image, which is remarkable. The potential use cases for this technology are vast. Reflecting on the capabilities of SAM 1 and the innovative applications people found for it, SAM 2 promises to be truly game-changing. You can see right here that using SAM 2, you can select one or multiple objects in a video frame. For example, the boot is being selected, and you can see the different objects. SAM 2 is capable of strong zero-shot performance for objects, images, and videos not previously seen during model training, enabling use in a wide range of real-world applications. One of the most impressive features of SAM is its real-time interactivity and results. SAM 2 is designed for efficient video processing with streaming inference to enable real-time interactive applications. Imagine being able to track objects in real-time. The possibilities are endless. This technology could revolutionize augmented reality, allowing you to see where specific objects are in real-time. The applications extend far beyond that, potentially impacting numerous fields. And the best part is you can try the demo yourself to experience its capabilities firsthand. For example, you can create effects here. So if you click this try it out button and click accept, it manages to load up the demo. And you can see right here, you can pretty much track anything in this video. For example, let's say I wanted to track the ball. I could just click the ball right here. And you can see that for the rest of the video, if I just click track objects, you can see right here that for the rest of the video, it is going to go ahead and track exactly where that object is. And it's pretty crazy. I mean, it's just completely remarkable how AI systems can do this. Literally being able to track something like someone's foot is unusual. It's definitely strange, but it's also interesting. I think this kind of technology will be used by creative people to do some really innovative things. So that's all for today's video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a like and subscribe to the channel for more interesting content like this. Thank you for watching and have a great day.